Might actually give up our first blood. They're gonna have a, a bunch of slows with the blood grenades. Another round of the Brocket Barrage shortly. Toss back on the Luna bot lane. Oh, they're in trouble with the TP rotation. They might both die on Spirit if they don't get quickly get the kill into K1, which they will, but it's not gonna matter in the end. Another round of the Rocket Barrage. And this was exactly what I was speaking about inside the draft. Those two points Rocket Barrage give you so much potential for the turnaround. They are blown up from four to zero. I mean, even your is rotating. I think Blink is getting delivered on the courier, but unfortunately, it's just a couple of seconds too late. Heroic have already repositioned. They're going in. Oh, besides K1, he's got a big one. Eclipse as well, but the boys playing behind him. They're going to turn it. Well, there's nothing they need to worry about. Soulbind for the double pulverize heroic. Welcome Dude. to the massacre. Mm -hmm. Collapse is going to run in. A Phantom's Embracer for the Tiny is so frustrating. So Wall is going to be used. Claps is trying to run down Schofield. They're going to be cautious. They step a bit too far over. The backstab is coming from Analog. And now Divai Lama just sums back in. You'll cancel the pulverize, but it, oh, it's just, it just doesn't matter. No, they're, they're being crushed. Yeah. Do they really want to go on K1 with the Aegis? Smoke's going to pop. Maybe we'll get the Kitchen's jump from the support. Kill. That's not bad. That is not bad. Can they kill him, will make it really difficult, though. Lol has to use a BKB to just get the kill, and now it means it's a BKB where he's not retreating or, or right-clicking at all, because K1's going to be able to enter pretty shortly. And with the Eclipse damage, they should be able to continue to chase me. Well, Divine Lama? Lama also wants to catch up to Lol. Are you with the SD is going to feel a little bit lackluster. Jump in, your Toro. Well, they tried onto KJ last time. Looks like if they're able to bring him down before the Glimmer Cape, it'll be a bit easier. Now Divai Lama's looking to enter. So, geez, I don't know. It's looking messy with the pulverized mechanic with the, the soul bind, but regardless, it works out into their favor. Beyond godlike here for analog. Ooh, mirror. Okay. Maybe a toss back? Toss back. Instant BKB. K1's not even going to give them that opportunity to maybe play with the toss back. Divai Lama attempts as well with the pulverize. No slow to swords going to protect Lao. Divai Lama's stuck deep inside, but. Are they actually going to be able to capitalize? Nice it's a pretty good vacuum. Avalanche to follow as well. Two heroes vulnerable now. Lars having a decent though. fight on the Lina. We are actually finally starting to see some of the damage output once Lal is able to stand strong, but I don't know if they're going to be able to get more. Yator is attempting quick glimmer cape, and now he may have gone too far, so has the BKB to work with. Her Here's that dragon form. Wait, wait, wait. That's... Cool. Oh, <laughs> he yeah, ran into the gun. beam. They're gonna try and jump. Hector. BKB. Is it enough damage? Low. Standing strong. Lotus are once again is gonna be able to protect him, but once K1 activates, Eclipse is gonna be able to run forward. Just the raw net worth lead. It's too much. The vacuum is nice, but That's it does it. not matter in the end. K1. Ooh. Okay, they got him. They really don't have to Oh my team. god. Look at that. Oh my lord. Oh, Luna is oh. in. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> god damn. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the illusion. I <laughs> uh, did the Divine Lama doing this thing. Oh, Mirror jump in. Mimo as well. Lau. It's going to be okay, actually. K1 was a little bit hesitant to continue. Running down the lean up. Thrones exposed. They want killers. Or they can win the game. Whatever they want. K1's going to turn to the Ancient. Meanwhile, Divine Lama just wants to, to add the, to the tally. It's a good vacuum, but there's no follow-up. Jeez, a cord spirit. Uh, not Jeez. the game they would hope to remember. Yeah, Team Spirit. They... He's dead. Yeah. Well done. Telekinesis into the skew up. That's a big right click as well. Nice high roll. And he's going to zone your Toro away. Oh, Pushka is dead. Yeah, uh, yeah, 100%. They're going to make sure they tank up on the Rock Barrage. Divai Lama gets the kill. Yeah, I mean, also Lal as well. Divai Lama with the Diffusal already, along with the Rolling Thunder. Analog's going to connect and. I don't know, man. This is starting to look very reminiscent of our previous game. This There's is not a good react. spot for them. Yeah, Schofield's going to run into a couple. Does Analog get out, though? Lal might be able to toss him back. Meanwhile, wait, Schofield. he's running in. Analog. Schofield's even going to try and drop the kisses on his dying breath. It's a decent chunk Arl? of damage onto Lal with the vessel still applied. Is that They're going to get a return kill. Well done. And what? What a good one as well. Troll now is joining in as well. K1. <laughs> so maybe they're going to look to try and force down Could some of the objectives. Collapse mid lane. KJ. 
Uh, he's fine, though. Right, Maybe with too, Yator yeah. here, it's a bit of a different story. KJ, Parvis given over the last second. Rolling Thunder is stolen. But the kisses along with the Rolling Thunder, it's just a great Collapse combination. It's going to net them the kill onto Mag. Meanwhile, Lyle's still going to be able to reinitiate. Scofield leaps over the Rubik's Cube. And now this is looking scary for Spirit. Even K1's going to look to enter the fray. But Poshka wants to finish can blow onto Schofield. Is he even going to be able to get the damage? Avalanche just Roll on the tip in. will secure it. But it puts Lal in the compromised position where he had to edge too far forward. Schofield, smoke pops. Oh, dude, that's Instant D world. Divide Lama is going to be in. A lot of hate for Maposhka. I don't know if they saw Mirror, though, before the Glimmer Cape. And now Divide Llama is well inside the bridge. They're actually going to look to try and take the fight off the back of the buyback. Divide Llama is in a bit of an awkward spot now, but Collapse. they're not going to jump Ooh. into it. Oh, nice cookie! The cookie! Well done. Now there we go. In they jump. K1's going to be able to react to Lincoln's protection. Divide Llama as well. That's a huge rolling thunder! The chaos! RP, it yeah. might not work. K1's almost dying, but he got the battle chance off! Last second ultimate from K1. Now he's going to be able to stand strong and get you. Taurus, the damage enough? It's not! Yutoro is somehow still alive. Waveform back to the base. And now you just got to get out. Team Spirit, they buy back on Collapse. It. They will keep Yutoro alive. Dubai Lama and Enelik are actually oh, thinking about standing Laurel? strong on the high ground. Dubai Lama swash back into the middle. Collapse. No, the Will of Wisp not going to matter. Skewer out into the grasping hands of Yutoro. And with the crits raining down, they'll be able to kill Dubai Lama as well. Just jumps straight on top of where Heroga currently smoked, and that is a great pick off if they can kill him. BKB, Lal is out. Great yours from, I believe, Mirror to be able to slow down K1. Still there on the hunt. K1's finally going to be able to catch up to the Tiny, so Lal will go down. Where is your Toro? Morphling getting control to the northern side. Schofield's going to be able to land the cookie. Your Toro's still playing Completely with the gaited. ages. K1 might be in some danger. BKB already expanded. Oh, Clash's going to be able to find the RP onto 2K1, though. Activates the battle train, stands strong, it's a dieback on collapse. Now the hex is there as well. And once K1 is locked onto his target, all he's gonna be worried about is Mutori turning back into the, the troll for the replicate. Now with that mischance, K1 cannot win the man fight. But there's another battle going on down to the south. Dubai Lama with the supports attempt to deal with Mira. They're gonna do so successfully. Troll buyback. Operation Kite Yutoro. And he is out. Attempting at a TP. There is no stuns to cancel it, however. Maposhka oh. also will look to escape. The bash is there. Divai Lama clips him at the buzzer. Yeah, he run didn't up to the get north. the bat, Miposhka. Uh, I don't think he survived this, sir. Um, the bash didn't connect on the most important target, though. It didn't com connect on the Morphling, so... Lyle's got his... Time it back up in a couple of seconds, but he's just lacking the gold at the moment. He's going to respawn anyway soon. That bounty rune. Okay, one with the aggressive jump in. Collapse once again is going to be initiated on now with the Ignis Fartus. Or oh, the AoE control. Collapse is gone again and he can't even get a spell off. Heroic. It took them a while, but Yatoru does not get him a single right click off with the rapier. Right? 51 minutes in. Heroic will find the 2-0 over Spirit. Whoa. Just, wow, congratulations.